good morning students in the previous lecture i have already explained you the strong acid and the strong base strong acid and the strong base in dilution of acid if the h ions produces large number of h ion in the solution that will be the strong acid and the le less number of h ion produced in the solution that is weak acid same like the base also if large number of oh ion produced in the uh, solution that is a strong base and the less number of oh uh, produced in the uh, solution that is the weak base now with the help of indicators we can identify the either the solution acid or base now there are four types of indicators which i have already discussed in the previous lecture the first is the natural indicators second is synthetic indicators third is olfactory indicators and fourth is universal indicator now today i shall take up the universal indicator which i am going to write on the blackboard there are four types of four types of indicators first natural indicators natural indicator second synthetic indicator third is olfactory olfactory means smell with the help of smell we can identify the substance olfactory indicators and fourth one is the universal indicator this universal indicator is the most important indicators this universal indicator and the what is universal indicator universal indicator is a, um, a mixture of different uh, indicators or you can say the mixture of uh, different numbers of indicators and it shows the different different colors in the different different concentration of the acid or the base if the acid is strong it will show different color if the acid is weak it will show different color if the base is strong it will show the uh, different in color and the weak base different in color so with the help of color we can identify that the solution is a strong acid or weak acid strong base or weak base with the help of universal indicator now write the definition universal indicator now well, first i will drop universal indicator it is a mixture of of different number number of indicator is called universal indicator the different color shows at different ph value now write it
Now, have you cupped it? Now, next one, the strong acid. Strong strength of an acid. Strength of an acid or base. Underline this. Now the strength of an uh, strength of an acid or base, it depends on the number of the H ions and the OH ion produced by them. Means if the H ion produce large number of H ion, that is a strong acid. If produce OH ion large in number, that is a strong base. Now write the strength of an acid or base. Underline this is another point. Now write. Strength of an acid or base strength of acid or base depends on the depends on the number of H ion H ion or OH ions produced by them produced by them large large the number of H ions produced by an acid acid and it will be this strong acid it will be strong acid now you have copied shall I rub Now, large number of number of OH ion produced by the base the base it will be strong base now copy
here is the diagram Here it is a seven marks. Seven is a neutral point. This is neutral. Neutral. Basic nature increases. Acidic nature increases. Now here it is a seven neutral. This is the H ion and this is the OH ion. Now variation of pH with the change in change in concentration with change in concentration of H ions in aqueous and OH ion in 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 solution in variation of pH with the change in concern in concentration of H ion in aqueous solution and OH ion ion in aqueous solution each OH ion in the liquid ions in aqueous aqueous solution now note this this is the H ion yeah, this is the H ion now here you see this is the neutral 7 is the neutral when we move from here to here then it will the acidic nature will be increased when we move from 7 to here. Means when we move 7 to left hand side, then with the acidic nature will increase. When we move from 7 to right hand side, then the basic nature will increase. Now OHN. Now see the space and here you see the space of this one. And write down. Now see, now have you copied? 
After that, we will study about the pH scale. What is pH scale? pH scale. The scale, pH scale, the scale which is used for the measuring of the H ions or OH ions in the solution. With the help of scale, we can measure the length. With the help of meter, we can measure the length. With the help of balance, we measure the weight of the substances. Same like here, uh, the pH scale. With the help of pH scale, we know the uh, strength of the uh, strong acid or a strong base. Now, you see, write the pH scale. Yeah, I have completed. Shall I write? Now, third one is the pH scale. The scale used for measuring used for measuring Measuring H ions H ion concentration H ion concentration Now the P this P, P stand for potent. This is the potent means in German we say power. In German, in German it means power. So what is pH? To measure the power of the hydrogen. To measure the power of hydrogen. This is called pH. And this is called pH. No, right? Now, pH is, it is clear to you? Now the pH scale means the scale on which the number is marked. Have you seen the um, uh, scale, measuring scale, there is a marked number. And with the help of the number we can uh, read that how much uh, centimeter is long, how meter is long. That is measured by the scale. The same like here, the, on the scale the number is marked from 0 to 14 and that is known as pH scale. Now write the pH scale. The number which mark on the scale is called pH scale. It, 
it starts from 0 to 14. Now you copy. Have you copied? Now copy from the draw the scale. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and this is fourteen. It is clear, thirteen. One, three, thirteen. One, four, fourteen. Fourteen. Strong acid. Four, five. Moderate acid. Acid. Six, seven. Weak acid. Seven is neutral. And neutral <coughs> water. Range seven to Seven point eight pH. Then weak base moderate base. And a strong base. Eight, two, three, eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 
ಇಲ್ಲಿರೋದು ನಾನು ನೋಟ್ ಡೌನ್ ನಾ ಹಿಯರ್ ಯು ಸಿ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಸ್ಕೇಲ್ ಆನ್ ವಿಚ್ ದಿ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಜೀರೋ ಟು ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಮಾರ್ಕ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಅಲಾಟೆಡ್ ನಾ ಜೀರೋ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಜೀರೋ ಜೀರೋ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಅಪ್ ಟು ಹಿಯರ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರಾಂಗ್ ಆಸಿಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈವ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಮಾಡ್ರೇಟ್ ಆಸಿಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫೈವ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಇಸ್ ಎ ವೀಕ್ ಆಸಿಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಇಸ್ ಎ ನ್ಯೂಟ್ರಲ್ ನ್ಯೂಟ್ರಲ್ ವಾಟರ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ನ್ಯೂಟ್ರಲ್ ವಾಟರ್ ಇಸ್ ಗ್ರೀನಿಷ್ ಇನ್ ಕಲರ್ ವೈ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನ್ಯೂಟ್ರಲ್ ವಾಟರ್ ವಾಟರ್ ವೈ ವಾಟರ್ ಇಸ್ ನ್ಯೂಟ್ರಲ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ನೋ ಫ್ರೀ ಆಯನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೈ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನ್ಯೂಟ್ರಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇ ದೇ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ದ ಫ್ರೀ ಆಯನ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೈ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಪ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸ್ ದ ಆಯನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇ ಡೂ ನಾಟ್ ಪ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸ್ ದ ಆಯನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೈ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಫ್ರೀ ಆಯನ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೈ ದ ವಾಟರ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ನ್ಯೂಟ್ರಲ್ and it is greenish in color after that when we proceed from here to here this is the weak base and here to here the moderate and the last one is the uh, strong base now here you see the neutral when we move from here to here this is the when we move from 7 to 14 strong base and when we move from 7 to 0 that is strong acid so with the help of number we can identify either it is a strong acid or a weak acid or a strong base or a weak base and if it is a greenish in color the blood water and the blood is neutral water and blood blood of our body is neutral range between the 7.2 strong spelling strong acid and the strong base now copy now here you see another i am marking acidic character increases basic character increases here it is the seven is neutral when we move from 7 to towards the left the acidic character will increase when we move from 7 to right that the uh, basic character will be increases now here is 0 and here is 14 0 to 14 now copy down this is a ph scale copy down have you copied shall i wrap now right water is neutral because because of the 
absence of free ions absence of free ions and the ph is 7 and the value of uh, water uh, ph is 7 now underline this one now right solution with ph 0 3 strong acid with ph moderate acid with ph 5 to 7 are weak acid this is the first second solution with ph 7 to 9 are weak base with ph 9 to 12 are moderate base with ph 12 to 14 are strong base it is a dark blue color it is a dark blue color and this is the uh, here it is a reddish brick red brick red color color co l stand for color write it now remember that ph now remember the ph is simply num now have you copied now write that the ph is a simply c 
सिंपली नंबर विच रिप्रेजेंट विच रिप्रेजेंट एसिडिक और बेस इन नेचर इन द सोल्यूशन बेस इन नेचर इन द सोल्यूशन इन द सोल्यूशन Now, remember that pH is a simply number which represent acidic or base in the nature in the solution. Now, nature in the solution. Now here you see the number pH three to five means moderate acid, five to seven means are weak acid, and when the seven to nine are the weak base, and nine to twelve are the moderate base. and the 12 to 14 are the strong base this is the simply number which represent the acid or base the ph scale now it is clear this range of the ph scale which i have already explained you now you think shall i rap i think you have written now you copy down now nowadays the ph meter or the electronic device is used to measure the uh, ph of the solution now right which i am going to write on the blackboard right for measurement of the solution ph meter and electronic device electronic device is used are used are used to measure the ph value are used to measure the ph value right now it is clear now also remember that that the 10 zero is greater than the 10 minus 1 is greater than the minus 2 greater than the minus 3 greater than the minus 4 so on when we see the 10 zero means zero marks of the uh, acid the 10 uh, zero uh, number is greater than the 10 1 minus 1 and 10 1 minus is greater than the this one and 10 minus 2 is greater than the uh, 10 minus 3 and the uh, uh, then 10 uh, rest to the power minus 3 is greater than this and the so on and when we move up to the 7 after that it going on decreases now it is clear now formula have you written
formula used if h is equal to 10 minus x m then p h is equal to x this is the first formula and the second one h n and the o h n is equal to k is the constant of water is equal to 10 raised to the power minus 14 at 298 Kelvin. Therefore, H ion is equal to 10 raised to the power minus 14 OH ion or OH ion is equal to 10 raised to the power minus 14 upon H ion. This is the formula. I learned this formula to calculate the pH of the acid or pH of the base. Now this is about the universal indicators. Now here you see the formula if H n is equal to 10 minus X m then the pH is equal to X. Second formula, if the H ion and OH ion is equal to, K is the constant of water is equal to 10 raised to the power minus 14 at 298 Kelvin temperature. Means it is 298 uh, Kelvin. This is the temperature. Now, therefore, the H ion is equal to 10 raised to the power minus 14 upon OH ion or OH ion when this OH ion this OH ion minus is equal to 10 raised to the power minus 14 upon H ion and with the help of this formula you can uh, identify the either uh, how much uh, acid is strong how much acid is weak and how much uh, how much uh, strong base and the how much uh, weak base or moderate base or moderate acid with the help of this formula you can solve your numericals now now another one, this is up to the universal indicator. Now what is the pH value in our daily life? There is a very, very important that a pH value of uh, value in our daily life. Effects of pH value. Effect of pH. Importance. Importance of pH in everyday life. In everyday life. There are so many points I am writing on this point. The plants and the animals are plants and animals Pla are plants and animals sensitive a 
एसी एन एस टी आई वी ई सेंसिटिव आर प्लांट्स एंड एनिमल्स नो राइट प्लांट्स एंड एनिमल्स आर सेंसिटिव प्लांट्स एंड एनिमल्स आर सेंसिटिव now plants and animals are sensitive this is the first and the second ph of the soil soil third ph in our digestive system ph in our digestive system all of you will discuss ph in our digestive system and the ph change ph ph change as the cause of cause of tooth decay fifth self defense by animals and plants through chemical chemical now here the first uh, ph uh, importance of the ph in our uh, everyday life that first point is the plants and animals are sensitive second is the ph of the soil third is the ph in our digestive system and fourth is ph change as the cause of tooth decay and the fifth one self defense by animals and plants through chemical warfare now to first we will discuss about the uh, plant and the animals are sensitive first point ek so now then importance of the ph in our everyday day life we will discuss in the next lab next lecture okay that's all for today learn by heart remember it if there is any problem then ask you me ask okay in zoom classes you can ask okay